Kevin Backland after being attacked by four pit bulls in Puyallup. He had to get more than 100 stitches, and his condition won't be back to normal for a while. The dogs involved have several different owners, and none of the owners showed up to court today. But they say they alerted UPS about the dangerous dogs, so they are not liable. These are some of the pictures of the pit bulls that attacked him. Right now, they're being quarantined by the Tacoma Humane Society. Kevin is hoping a judge will uphold the quarantine and order the owners to do a number of safety measures before getting the dogs back. This is the sign the owners had up at the time of the attack uh, if we want to show you that eventually but Kevin's attorney says you can barely read it and it was not enough to warn Kevin to stay off property now Kevin who is a former Nevada State Trooper used his belt to fight off the dogs he ran on top of a trailer and called 911 for help when Ording Valley firefighters arrived at the scene they say a relative of one of the dog owners refused to open the gates so rescuers could get to Kevin so first responders had to actually ram the fence to get to him. I can't get out there. I said they surrounded me. Hey man, I need help. I feel bad for the guy, but you know what's the sad part about it? Both dogs were doing their job. Even though um, UPS is his employer, they did not own the dogs. They were not aware of the viciousness nature of the dogs, nor how many dogs. Legally, it comes down to the owner of the animals. And if you have animals, multiple animals that are trained to kill an individual, then you need to do a lot to warn people who may approach the property. This is just a sad situation, and I will, in the future, make attempts that a situation like this never occurs, especially to me. Now, one of the owners of the dogs actually called 911. We, you heard that just a second ago. He basically said, look, we have $3 million worth of property at our location, and the dogs were trained to do what they were supposed to do. When asked if he thinks, if Kevin thinks the pit bulls should be put down, Kevin says that decision should be up to the courts, and we expect a decision from the judge in the next 10 days. But he definitely wants the owners to do a number of things, including posting better signs and enclosures for the dogs. Kevin's attorney says they are preparing for a possible civil lawsuit. As for criminal charges, no word yet on that. Marnie? Wow, Hannah, he's been through.